Home is more than a building. It's more than an address. It's a place to live and thrive. But for many people, the high cost of housing makes finding a home inaccessible. Today, the Washington, D.C. metro region faces an affordable housing crisis. In an area with one of the highest costs of living in the country, there's an affordable housing deficit in the tens of thousands. This means many of the people who play a vital role in our local economy are left with the choice of unattainable housing costs or unmanageable commutes. The affordable housing burden is especially real for veterans. There are more than 236,000 veterans in the DC metro area, and between 20 and 34% remain housing cost burden. Terwilliger Place offers hope. Thanks to American Legion Post 139 and the Arlington Partnership for Affordable Housing, APA, Terwilliger Place provides an innovative solution to offer housing, a sense of community, and support services to veterans and their families. My name is Carmen Romero. I'm the president and CEO of the Arlington Partnership for Affordable Housing, APA. We're a nonprofit organization founded in 1989 by four Arlington families that really wanted to help um, solve the problem of affordable housing in this community. And since then, we are a regional organization. In 2017, we went from just serving Arlington to now serving the greater uh, Washington, D.C. metro area. The scope of the project is local in nature. How do we create high quality, beautiful, affordable housing in one of the highest areas of opportunity in the country? The significance of the project is twofold. We're, we're solving for much needed affordable housing, 160 units, and we're co-locating with our partner, the American Legion Post 139. My name is Bob Romano. Currently, I'm the second vice commander of American Legion Post 139. Myself and another gentleman, we started the project back in 2014. I ran for post commander and then I get into the finances. I get into everything uh, regarding the post and I realized that uh, uh, we weren't gonna survive as a post. The building that we were in, we are in now was built in 1959. Of course, prior to that, we were in a house that was on the property and had been there for a century. Um, that house, of course, is gone. And, and in 1920, when we were formed, we bought that particular piece of property. The building is very old. It's, it is, it is run, getting run down. The biggest challenge was financial. We had a building that was what I call a mechanical nightmare. And I gave my wife a tour of the post. As we walked out of the post, her comment to me was, I'm never going back in that building again. The problem today with American Legion and veterans organizations today is it's an aging popula population. Uh, buildings are older. Uh, and we're not replenishing the membership. We could not bring young veterans into that post. APA saw an opportunity to reimagine the facilities in a way that both served the needs of Post 139 and created new affordable housing with a focus on serving veterans and their families. My involvement in the Terwilliger project started very early in the pre-development stage. APA reached out to me based on my expertise in veterans housing. And at the time I was running Bring Them Homes, a veterans initiative in partnership with LISP. And with those funds, I was able to provide uh, uh, money so that we could visit comparable veterans projects in other markets. And with that, it generated a lot of new ideas of how we could take this project from just being affordable housing to having a special targeting to veterans. One of the things that we put forward was we had experience working with other nonprofits to achieve more than just a real estate deal. From the moment we started working with Post 139, we were two organizations that are led with mission and values first, right? Anyone can build a seven-story building um, and be successful in a market like Arlington. But we both wanted more than that. We wanted to serve. They wanted to serve veterans in the Arlington community. We wanted to help solve an affordable housing problem. And we realized that together, we can make so much of that vision happen. And, you know, we are lucky. We, we, you know, we were embraced by the Arlington County community, by so many folks who were really inspired by what, what we set out to do. Terwilliger Place is located in the Virginia Square neighborhood of Arlington, Virginia, right in the heart of a vibrant community 
near the Pentagon. The property is situated on 1.4 acres and includes a 6,000 square foot post hall with breakout rooms and social areas. The property's 160 units of affordable housing include one, two, and three bedroom units with modern design and finishes. It's a place to call home and a home to be proud of. My name is Kia Weatherspoon and I am the interior designer with Determined by Design on the Afro Project. My design process, it's very, very specific. You always, always start with the land, right? The origin stories of the land, of the space, and of a community. And then you focus on the site and the organizations and the people um, who are making this project come to fruition. I am now officially a 21-year veteran. Um, so when I was approached to do this project with the APA team, it was one of the first times that there was a project that through interior design connected me back to my military service and my military background. Our process is always about research, it's about people, it's about community, and making sure that narrative is woven through the building um, and not just design trends that feel good for the moment. We wanna create something that is about connection and legacy um, and reimagining specifically on the post 139 side, um, how can the new post home be a haven and a place for the next generation of veterans who are a lot younger um, than traditional post members of the past? In Terwilliger Place, American Legion Post 139 now has a modern, versatile facility that retains its location in the center of the community. The post is better equipped to meet the needs of a new generation of veterans, and APA's financial partnership and innovative financing of the project enable Post 139 to use its property as a valuable asset, turning financial challenges into positive returns. To me, APA was always a good, uh, good idea because I'm very familiar with APA's work and uh, uh, the affordable housing that you've done all, all through that, throughout the county. Everybody else just wanted to buy the property and have Post 139 find another piece of land in Arlington to build a post home. APA was the only one that really had veterans housing, medium income housing, and a post home downstairs for 139. We were, you know, immediately um, committed to wanting to be that partner to carry the flag for them. The partnership between APA and American Legion Post 139 is a model for future development projects with veteran services organizations and other mission-driven groups who hold facilities in need of revitalization. Even during one of the most challenging periods for our nation and for the construction industry, Terwilliger Place delivered on time and on budget. It's a place where uh, veterans can come in to mingle, ha have a beer, socialize, uh, and a, com a comfortable atmosphere. We're hoping to see an integration of those veterans uh, in the programs at the American Legion Post 139, reinvigorating their programs as well as helping them continue their mission into the next generation. It's going to be a space where it is about meeting you exactly where you are, um, and really foster community camaraderie, which is at the core of what most of everyone's military service really is. I think they're going to inspire veterans to want to come back and be part of this new American Legion Post vision, and then hopefully inspiring other veteran organizations throughout the Commonwealth and country with what they've done. Thanks to the vision of American Legion Post 139 leaders, the enthusiastic support of the Arlington County government and APA's creative solutions. Terwilliger Place opened to its first residence in 2022. American Legion Post 139 now has a revitalized facility to serve veterans and the community, and 160 families have an affordable place to call home in the heart of Arlington, at the center of opportunity. To learn more about the Terwilliger Place project, visit terwilligerplace.com.